I'm not a professional and I don't work for Kiddy or something like that, but it's a very good printer, even if I had issues. Um, if you are interested a little bit in how it works, you fine tune everything and after you have very good printer with very good product quality. So this video is for people who, who get error message um, and stop Z still triggered after retract and had this kind of bed mesh. Um, I have this printer since uh, December and it worked during one month and now I have uh, I had a lot of problem and I found out why so the first thing to do is you go on configuration okay I will explain what you need to change so I was on forums uh, on internet try to find out what was wrong and I start modifying this printer CFG uh, file and the uh, other one which I show you after so first of all you go on you go on stepper Z okay and here you can copy the difference between your file and mine change it like that Okay, same for stepper Z1. Change the difference. Okay. After you go on Z tilt, okay, you change horizontal move Z then. Okay. After you go on TMC2209, stepper Z. Interpolate but uh, false instead of true. Same for TMC2209 stepper Z1. Interpolate false. Okay, now we go down. Sorry for the video quality. Not professional. So now on Smart Effector. The speed the 2.5 okay sample one instead of two and also this you need to change okay so you go down bed mesh horizontal move z then um, everything else is normally like that okay okay so now you you save and restart now we close mine now you go on g code macro okay so this this one runs this one <coughs> and you here you will do a search okay so control f and you look for m 104 so this is um, the nozzle temperature so the first one is this one okay clear nozzle i will explain why i change that so m104 s here normally you have 140 on your change it to 80 okay so now we check a second one okay everywhere there is a, on the m104 s every, everywhere there is zero you leave it as it is and you go okay so here in the print start you also have one at 140 you change it to 80 also this you leave it this is okay okay now you have in the g code macro m4029 also you have one with the s140 you change it to 80. you can see here is when it clear the nozzle so we go up to 280 
and now you ask him to cool at one at 80 degree instead of uh, 140 okay so now you save and restart okay so <coughs> why i've done that when you do a calibration here most of the time it works you should have a a correct bed mesh, I will say. <coughs> but if the printer is hot, too hot, and if the, this one is too hot, it will fail. Okay. So even when you do this, um, this one, this one will clear the nozzle over there in the back and cool down to 140 degrees what we've done is we changed this temperature to 80 degrees okay because i did a lot of tests and um, when this is a probe okay so this one checks the position and if this one is above um, 100 degrees this one start to have some failures okay it, it cannot catch the, the point so after it clears the nozzle, it will go here and wait the bed is at temperature. But all this time, if you leave it 140, this one will be very hot. Okay, then after I will start checking points, tock, tock, tock. And this one at middle of the area, usually it will fail. And uh, you will have this error message uh, and stop Z still triggered after it tracked. Okay, we also change the, um, the speed. So when you will try to catch point, most of the time you, for, on yours it will go down two times. Okay, so now we ask him to go slower. So he let the time to for him to catch the point. And we ask him also to be a little bit higher. So he will be less affected by the bed temperature. Okay, so now you can try it and um, i hope it will work for you on mine now it's perfect so first i was re very frustrated because i bought it just to print not to be a kiddie developer but in fact it's interesting and i when i check all the forums a lot of people have issues with uh, with printer of this generation so so maybe it's normal or not i don't know but uh, this is a part i I printed with uh, this KD plus four, and it's good quality. It's ABS, and uh, yeah. So I hope it works for you. And let me know in the comments uh, if it works or not. Uh, hope it helps. See you.